the prime factorization of 715 is to do the prime factorization first we should frame it in this way c that is 715 okay next for this number the last digit is 5 so we take 5 here the first number is 7 a number close to 7 in 5 table is 5 once 5 7 minus 5 2 2 carried forward making it 21 a number close to 21 in 5 table is 5 4 20 21 minus 20 is 1 1 carried forward making it 15 when do we get 15 in 5 table? 5, 3 is 15. Now for this number, the last digit 3, which is not even. So this number not divisible by 2. Next to prime number 3. To check divisibility by 3, for that we add the digits. That is 1 plus 4 plus 3. We get 8. Is 8 divisible by 3? No. So this number also not divisible by 3. Next prime number 5. The last digit is neither 0 nor 5. So this number is not divisible by 5. Next prime number is 7. Let us check divisibility by 7. In this way. 143 by 7. 7 ones, 7 twos, 14. 3 we don't get in 7 table. So this number is not divisible by 7. Next prime number is 11. To check divisibility by 11, we take the difference of sum of alternate numbers. What I mean is C. Here we have 143. You add alternate digits in this way. So 1 plus 3, 4. And left out is one number 4. Now you take the difference. 4 minus 4, 0. We got 0. 0 is divisible by 11. So this number also divisible by 11. Okay. So we take 11 here. The first number is 1. 1 smaller than 11. So we take two numbers. That is 14. Whenever you are taking two numbers compulsory, you should put zero. At the start, whether I put zero or not, it doesn't make any difference. So I am not writing zero here. Now, here we have 14. A number close to 14 in 11 table is 11 once 11. 14 minus 11, 3. 3 carried forward making it 33. When do we get 33 in 11 table? 11, 3 is 33. Now here we have 13. 13 is a prime number so we take 13 once 13. We got 1 here. So the prime factorization of 715 is the product of these numbers. That is 5 into 11 into 13. So this is the prime factorization of 715. This also called as product of prime numbers of 715. Am I clear?